I don't know. I just don't know what to do. It, we just been everywhere and uh, just trying to get some answers. Their escape to safety has been a back and forth battle from CODA to a designated hotel. Checked us in over there and then they shot us back over here and then we came back from over here to go back over there to get to, to, to just get a, a wristband. The hotel lobbies have seen several hundreds of faces seeking refuge, but also has had to turn away several of these evacuees. In less than 24 hours, their capacities have hit nearly 90 percent. We wish there was a better uh, you know, global initiative to help protect this industry because in time of need like now, um, this is where we need these resources to be open and operating. VJ Patel with the Austin Hotel Lodging Association says the emergency market demand got to hotels before the Capital Area Shelter Hub could secure more rooms needed. They already maxed out 15 in the area. Not only that, but hotels aren't staffed for 90% capacity right now. COVID-19 also caused more than half of those Austin area hotels to furlough their employees. But, you know, the good news is some of them were brought back because the market reached 50%. But I don't think any hotel is prepared for 100% occupancy, knowing that it was not predicted to come until June of next year.